Welcome to MFL Outdoors and tonight we're back on the foxes. It's Sunday night as usual <laughs> uh, and We've had a fox coming in around the farm, so I'm here tonight to see if it comes in uh, I've got my usual Dairy Lee Dunker and uh, Tonight I've got coffee instead of Marmite. Yes, I decided to give Marmite a miss tonight <laughs> uh, The weather's absolutely beautiful. It's raining um, it's cold, but apart from that, it's just your usual spring day in the UK. Okay, let's wait for dark to come as usual and see how we get on. It's the usual setup for here tonight. Uh, that's my Browning T bolt and 17 HMR. Uh, on that, I've got the Hick Micro Alpex 4K with LRF. I'm using a Wicked Light that has the 850 and the 940 illuminator built in so I can just swap over it also has a red LED um, but I don't really use that very much I'm using the uh, Recon tripod and the Mambili um, premium saddle mount what I've actually done as well is I've tucked myself right in the corner I've put the truck right up as close as I can into the, where the sheds are um, because the moon will come out later on and I don't want to be lit up like a Christmas tree and from back out there on the field um, It just looks black over here, which is exactly what I want if mr. Fox turns up or mrs. Fox uh, There's no discrimination on here As you can see the alpacas are keeping me company at the moment Down at the bottom there you can see the rabbits, they're about 200 metres away. The field's actually 215 metres when I lasered it to the end. I've just walked along a little bit um, to look down we've got like one big field and I can't see that one from where I'm standing so I've moved along but it doesn't look like there's anything in here just the horses and there's a couple of rabbits and that there is a heron um, I just saw it in the middle field it took off though before I got to get a good close-up of it Well, still no fox showing. Looks like it's going to be a waiting game. I hope it is going to show up tonight. Don't fancy uh, sitting out here. It's pretty cold uh, for no reason at all. While we're waiting for a fox to show, we might as well have some interaction. Just for a bit of fun, which alpaca is the odd one out? A, B, C or D? Drop your answer in the comments below with your reason why and I'll let you know who was correct on the next video. Right, I've decided to put the Fox Pro caller out. Maybe give that a try a bit later on. And uh, I've, I've mounted that on a tripod, but I'll show you that in a minute. Right, and all I've done is bought a, a cheap tripod, camera tripod, and uh, put the call on that. I think it helps with elevating it off the ground and also finding it later on the night. So that's out there, and uh, uh, we'll retreat back to the vehicle now and see how we get on. You can just see where the caller is through the thermal. The alpacas have moved out into the field, which isn't ideal. I prefer them up this end with me. That could be a problem if there's a fox coming up that way. Hopefully they'll make their way back up. They normally do where, and when they get tired, they, they normally sleep underneath the tree near to where I am. Here 
Here's Timmy, my rat and rabbit in sidekick. Um, he's come up to see me. He sometimes hangs on and stays. Depends how he feels. And here's the first rat of the night. It's just in there uh, where the chicken run is, just through the fence. Not a lot I can do tonight though. I don't have the air rifle with me. And my main objective is the fox tonight. So I'll have to come back on another night. This one's actually just off to the right of me. Um, probably about 15 metres, something like that. This one's at about the same distance, but right in front of me. Hope he doesn't come down this way. This one's actually to the back of me, so I'm surrounded. Uh, perhaps they're going to get their own back. Even though they're rats, it's still interesting watching them, watching what they get up to and how they uh, act when they think uh, nobody's about. Okay, well it's uh, just gone one o'clock and there's been no show of any foxes. There's a few rats as you can see around. I'll have to come back for them uh, on another night. But uh, now I'm going to have my uh, coffee and just uh, have my Dairy Dunk as well. And then uh, I think I'll wait till two and if there's no show I'll call it a night. But we'll see if anything else comes along. As you can see we've got a full moon and I haven't turned hairy or started howling. Well not tonight anyhow, so it's all good. That you can see on the hedge line is a roe deer. Now you quite often get them down there eating off the trees. Here's a fox coming in. Well that came in quick. Right, well it's now 20 past one in the morning and I've been waiting ages to get this one. But uh, it came in, I just gave it a squeak uh, with my own mouth. <laughs> I haven't used anything. Uh, it's taken me two nights to get this one. Uh, but uh, we've got it. I'll go and pick it up in a minute. Right, we'll go out and get this one. And find it. I'm just going to stop actually and have a look and see if I can find it there. Uh, yeah, it's straight over there. Let's see what this one is. It's cold tonight. I'm sure. Uh, that's a vixen so that was the one that shot at 89 yards I'll get that one back to the shed for the farmer bye it's cold now right make our way back to the vehicle now so uh, that was one vixen taken care of and I didn't even have to use the Fox Pro caller it just came in of its own accord uh, which was good. 
and this one won't be helping itself to any more ducks, which it had been doing. All that's left for me to say is, thanks very much for joining me on this one. Hope you enjoyed it, and we'll catch you on the next one. Take care, bye for now. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like, make a comment, and also if you could hit the subscribe button, uh, over 80% of people who watch the videos aren't subscribed. It really does help the channel. It only takes uh, a couple of minutes and it's free of charge. And if you click the notification bell, it'll let you know when all the new videos come out so you don't miss any. Thanks very much. Take care and I look forward to seeing you on the next one.